This song is very special to me, bro. I love this song so much. Player, this pimp don't lie. How many rap stars you know that went to Berkeley High? I'm always with a cup of bourbon. I'm in here choosing, you up here searching. Yo, yo, welcome to the show, everybody. It's me, Ben, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today, y'all, I was not expecting this, but the Stray Kids boys just dropped a video for The View, which happens to be, for those of y'all that are patrons, you already know, my favorite song on No Easy. It's my favorite song on No Easy. My favorite B-side. My favorite B-side on No Easy. Um, I'm in love with this song. And the fact that it's getting a full video. I need to not be emotional today because I just don't feel like I have the energy in me to actually get emotional. What's poppin' y'all? I'm thrilled to announce that I'm gonna be partnering up this week with Zero Cancer in the fight to end prostate cancer. We're gonna be raising money for the next couple of days, but we're culminating the entire event in a big old stream on my birthday, which is Monday the 6th at 4 p.m. EST over on my Twitch. I'm challenging you to help me raise $1,000 because throughout the week and throughout the rest of the month, even if you decide to donate later, even if it's not to our campaign, um, every donation throughout the month of September is doubled. So if we're able to raise $1,000 as a community, we're actually raising $2,000. My donation link lasts from the 1st through the 7th. Um, so if you want to donate specifically to our campaign, you can do that using that link. But I'm also going to hopefully remember to attach a link below that you can also donate to if my campaign is over. So like if you watch this video a little bit later and you still want to donate and I'm not doing the campaign anymore, you can still donate to Zero um, with this other link that I'm going to attach as well. Feel free to donate at any time throughout this sort of like short period of time that we've got going on. But during the stream, we're going to have some rewards for y'all that donate on stream. The way that we're going to do it this time around is we're going to be requesting K-pop music videos. So for $10, the low, low price of $10 donated to the charity, you can select any K-pop music video that you would like me to react to, preferably ones that I've already seen, you know, um, that we can watch on stream and hang out and enjoy together. But the difference is every $200, every $200 that we raise, I'm going to be doing the choreography I'm gonna try to do the choreography for each of the music videos that we watch when we hit 200. So if I'm watching a music video and we hit $200 raised in the first like, let's say like 20 minutes or something, then whatever music video I'm watching at that moment, I have to try to do the choreography for it. So it'll be an extra incentive for y'all to donate a little bit extra just so that you can make fun of me a little bit, um, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. Would really love to see y'all there. If you have any questions, feel free to just DM me on Twitter or leave a comment in this YouTube section below and I'll do my best to get back to you. Thank you so much for your continued support of me and I really hope that we're able to reach our goal for zero cancer this week. Let's do our part this week to end prostate cancer. I'll see y'all in chat. This song is very important to me. Off the bat, I love these lyrics so much. I love this song. The immediate feeling it gave me upon listening to it for the first time was indescribable. Those of y'all that watched the album review, y'all know. Y'all know that's what happened. Um, so we're gonna get to it. I just remembered, I was supposed to react to all the track videos. Y'all wanted me to do that. <gasps> I completely forgot to do that. Oh shit. Y'all still want me to do that? I can do that. We can see about doing that. It might be another day or two, maybe a little bit longer, let's be real. Um, but if y'all still want me to do that, we can do that. But in the meantime, we've got The View. The View, okay. Three, two, one, click. I'm gonna be soft. Catch it. Felix, I'm gonna be soft. I'm gonna be soft. You know, you're so pretty. When you feel stuck, like, do you know how much, do you understand how good it feels to feel so stuck? Like nothing is gonna impact what's happening to you, but then coming out of that and appreciating the view, I just, Chan, I would die for you. I like the view right now. Oh my God, this song is so good, bro. Han, ah, the visuals, Felix. <laughs> I love this song so much, y'all. I really cannot. I've listened, I've listened. This this album dropped like, what, like a week ago or something? Maybe a little longer than a week ago. I have listened to this song probably like well over a hundred times now. Because it's one of those songs that I just put on repeat. 
Like, why would I listen to another song that I also want to listen to when I want to listen to this one even more? So I just put it on repeat and I just, I just keep going and going and going. I love that Han mouthed the lyric with him. That was so cute. Oh, extra harmony part in the back is so pretty. Hot. I'm so glad they gave us a video for this, bro. Like, this is gonna end up being one of my favorite Stray Kids videos. Just because this is one of those songs that I did not expect was gonna get a video. Like, I guess, like, the track videos kind of count, right? Um, but like this got a full one. I don't know why they decided on this one because I felt like The View is one of the most least popular ones on the album. Um, the majority of my friends that I've talked to, let me just go look on Spotify, hold on. Let me just go look and see. Stray Kids, Stray Kids. Um, click on No Easy. The View has, yeah, way less plays than a lot, but actually a little bit more than I thought. I don't know, for whatever reason it feels like the view isn't nearly as popular among my friend group, which is fine. But like, I still wasn't expecting this to get a full video and it just makes me so happy. They're literally just having a good time appreciating the view. Look at the view, bro. Sungmin, boy. I like the view right now. God. This song is, I'll try to give y'all a bit of insight. Like this song is especially important to me because I have always, I don't know, like this is just like, everybody has like their things, right? This is just one of my things. I have always very much valued the view. So like if I'm on vacation, and there's like an opportunity to go to the top of something to see the view. Or there's like a, I don't know, someone's like, oh, let's just go shopping at this part of town because the view is really nice. It's really pretty there, right? I'm always down to do stuff like that. I'm a very visual person. I like looking at stuff. Um, I had always dreamed of living in a place where I felt like I had a view. And I currently live in an apartment that lives on like, a very sort of like flat part of town. And from the rooftop of the parking lot, you can see so much of the downtown area. And so I'll go up there a lot and just sit and think and just be out of my own head for a little bit. And I did not ever think I was gonna have an opportunity to live somewhere that had a view. So I've been so thankful for that view ever since I moved into this apartment. I'm getting emotional because I almost, well, the only reason I was able to move in in the first place was because Philly had faith in what I was doing with YouTube. I hadn't even started to make really any money from Patreon yet. And he was like, no, come on, move on down here. I'll pay for your rent for a couple months if you need me to. And that's when we started getting enough money from Patreon to start paying you know, for rent and stuff. Um, but now I finally have a view. I have a view now, you know, like I have a view. I like the view right now. This song is very special to me, bro. I love this song so much. Wow. Oh, not with the message. No, I don't even want to say it out loud. I don't even want to say it out loud. Chan vocals make me so happy. Oh my god, bro, this Changbin part. <sighs> Get him, Mino. Get him. That's like, yo, that's, that's really significant, okay? Like... I can sit here till I'm blue in the face and say, 
I finally achieved my dream after dreaming about it for 10 years. So y'all go out and do the same. It's not that easy, right? Like trying to keep track of something for anybody is really difficult sometimes because with all that sh life throws at you, it's hard to, it's hard to manage that and still like stay focused, right? Because when I started making videos, I guess like eight years ago, we're coming up on nine. I think I've been uploading consistently, like almost weekly on YouTube now for, yeah, like eight years. Um, there was a couple of times where I did stop uploading for a series of a few months. Um, one of those times was because I was having computer issues and I didn't have much of a choice. Um, but there was also a couple other times where I took a couple months off just because I was like, is this really what I wanna be doing? Um, and all it took was realizing that I was just not making the type of videos that I needed to be making. I had been sitting on the same type of content for too long and I needed to switch it up and start doing something else that made me happy instead. Um, and I'm glad I took the time to think about that because if I hadn't taken the time to think about it and just had sort of given up on what I was doing, I would certainly not be here doing my favorite thing in the world on a daily basis. So dreams come true to those who truly want them is, I don't know, that's, that's extra special to me because it, it means to me, dreams don't have an expiration date. Just because they don't come true maybe right when you want them to doesn't mean you should give up on them. And that was something I learned the hard way, but it ended up being the good way, if that makes sense. I'm like shaking. Until you have the view that you want, appreciate the view that you have now. Even if you think the view that you have right now is, you know, bad or you've been seeing the view for too long and you don't want to see it anymore, appreciate that view anyway. Because when that better view comes along, it's going to be unbelievable. You're not going to know what to do with yourself. If you're anything like me, you're not going to know what to do with yourself. I have almost cried like 50 times this video, I really. This has, been a, this has been a rough one. The moment I saw on Twitter that this one had dropped, I was like, oh, oh, I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can. Ooh. Y'all are so important to me, man. These boys are so important to me. I like the view right now. Ian, you look so cute in the yellow. I like the view right now. Exactly. Wherever I go, I'll be okay. <sighs> That's like an immediate favorite Stray Kids video ever. That's like top three for me all time for their music videos. I hope my like ramblings like made sense and they don't sound like disingenuous. Like I was just trying to speak about my feelings a little bit there. Um, but thank y'all for watching the video. Stay, I love y'all. I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for bearing with me. Like I said, hit me up over on Patreon if you wanna see what was popping over on that album review. I'll catch y'all this week over on Twitch as per usual. Normally on Mondays we do our, um, our Stray Kids content on stream, but um, this Monday we're doing a charity stream like I mentioned earlier on in the video. So y'all be sure to come through for that and hang out if you'd like to, would love to see y'all there. Um, but that's it for me, man. I hope this reaction finds fellow The View enthusiasts because we gotta stick together. Those of y'all that really love this song like I do, we've gotta stick together, I'm telling you. This one's special. I didn't cry though, I got real close. I'm glad I didn't cry, bro. I don't have the energy for that today. Thank y'all for watching, till next time. Love y'all very much, and peace, bye.